Hi everyone, Tech TV here. In for today's video, I'll gonna show you how to initialize and connect to Wi-Fi on this Epson EcoTank L11050 Wi-Fi and A3 printer. And without further ado, let's do the unboxing. Out of the box is we have the user's manual, an extra plastic bag, and a 1.5 meters USB cable, a power cord, and a set of 003 ink. Then after unboxing the unit, please remove all the adhesive tapes. After removing tapes, let's start to fill ink on its ink tank. Then after filling ink, just plug the power cord to start initialize the printer. Press the power button. After pressing the power button, just wait until the power LED becomes stable and ink indicator LED will turning on. And then when it's turned on, just press and hold the stop button for 5 seconds to initialize the printer. After press and holding the stop button, the power LED and ink indicator LED will flashing alternately. An ink initializing it may takes 5 to 10 minutes, just wait until the power LED indicator becomes stable or steady.
When power LED becomes stable, your printer is now ready. Then plug in the USB cable to install your printer. Then open any available browser on your PC. Then go to google.com. And then search for Epson EcoTank L11050 driver. Then select first in the list from Epson official support website. Just scroll down. Then select your PC operating system. And click go. Scroll down again. And download the Epson web installer for Windows for simple installation method. Click accept to download the printer driver. Then open the file to run the printer driver. On license agreement just click accept. Then click yes. And on additional agreements tab, again just click next. Since we have done filling ink, just click I have finished filling ink and click next. Then automatically it will downloading the required software, just wait until it's done downloading and installing the required software. Downloading the software it may take some time depending on your internet speed. So just wait until it's done. Here on connection method, we can select it's either wireless network connection or local USB cable connection, but this time we have to connect via Wi-Fi connection and click next. Then again, automatically it will downloading network utilities. Then now in order to connect automatically, just press and hold the Wi-Fi button for 5 seconds. until the blue light Wi-Fi indicator will flash alternately. Then click next. On IP settings, you can proceed by selecting the automatic IP address configuration or DHCP, then click next. Then now it's asking you to enter the administrator password if you are changing password after purchasing the product. But since we are not changing the password of this product, all we have to do is to locate the product serial number. 
and the product serial number of this Epson EcoTank L11050 printer is located under the printer top cover. Just get the serial number and enter as administrator password. Then click OK. and install the software by checking and click install. Then click install now. And then again it will automatically downloading the required additional software. Then wait again until it's done downloading and installing the additional software. After it finishes to install, you can now test print by clicking print test page. Then click Next. And we have successfully initialized and connected via wireless network or Wi-Fi connection of this Epson EcoTank L11050 printer. And then you can now proceed on online product registration or skip and click Finish. If you found this video helpful to you, Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you on my next video.